Hello and welcome back to our channel. Today we are going to post a quick tutorial that deals with a very annoying problem we have been running into lately. A lot of times, in fact. When we try to upload a design to Merge by Amazon, we regularly get this invalid PNG error. It looks like this mainly happens when we want to upload a design directly from Procreate. But every now and then we also see this error with files we have created in other programs. Even though we created our file at the correct size, in sRGB, and exported it as a PNG with a transparent background, Merge by Amazon says that the file is invalid. It took us a while to find a solution to this error, and today we want to share it with you, because we know that many of you are struggling with the same error. So here we are now in Procreate. Now let's go ahead and export this design. As always, we would just go to Tools, Share, and then select PNG. And then we would save the image to the Photos app on the iPad. Now let's try uploading this design to Merge by Amazon. As you can see, we get this error message again and the upload does not work. So when we get the error, the first thing we do is check the file. The size must be exactly 4500 by 5400 pixels, not a single pixel more or less. The file should be in sRGB with a transparent background and less than 25 megabytes in size. This is the case with our design. So here is a little workaround we found for this problem. Let's go back to Procreate and save the file again. But this time we are not going to choose Save Image and save the design to the iPad. Instead, we are going to select Save to Files. This way we can save it to a cloud service like iCloud or Google Docs. Ok, so let's try uploading the image again. But this time we will select the file in the cloud and voila, it works. We are not sure why that is, but it seems to work. And as we mentioned earlier, every now and then we run into the same error when we have created a file on the computer in a program like Photoshop or Illustrator. What we do then is manually add the PNG extension to the file name, and it seems to fix the problem as well. So we really have no idea what is causing this error. Please let us know if it works for you too, or if you have found another cause for it. We hope you found this video helpful, and if so, we would really appreciate it if you subscribe to our channel and leave a like. And if you want to know more about t-shirt design, we are currently doing a series explaining everything you need to know to set up your print files properly. Thanks for watching, and I see you in the next video!